efforts to slim down and get right kicking into the high gear in the new year, including tackling your diet and also learning to undergo a lifestyle change. Many struggling with eating healthy site access and time as a barrier, but experts say it doesn't have to be about all that. Joining us now to give us some tips on how to eat right, save time and money, we got Dr. Rowe. She's an award-winning health journalist and also an emotional eating coach. Dr. Rowe, always a pleasure. Welcome back. So, Happy New it Year. Is always, it is always a pleasure to be with you and Happy New Year to you. Thank you so much. All right, so let's dive right in. Your best tip for eating healthy, saving time, and money. Lay it on us. Okay, so my, my best tip is going to be multifactorial. <laughs> it's going to have legs. So the first thing is you have to have a plan. You, you, you want to eat healthy or you want to lose weight. Whatever it is, you have to have a plan, and it has to be a plan that, that you know, doesn't lack conviction. <laughs> so what I mean by that is if you, if you say you want to eat healthy to lose weight, um, then you're not going to just set out to lose weight. Uh, what you want to do is decide how many pounds you're going to lose and then how you're going to do it. Now, in terms of eating healthy um, and, your, and pre prepping for your meals and saving money, so how are you going to shop? The first thing I want you to do is to shop with a list because when you do so, you stick to the list. You also stick to your budget at the same time. So you see, you're not throwing things, extra foods in the basket that are not on the list, like salty or sweet snacks, for example. Um, so stick to the list, shop with a list, stick with a list. The other thing is buy, you know, you were looking at, at a video of, of, of meat, buy meat on sale. Because if you're going to eat red meat, I recommend that you buy organic, 100% grass-fed organic because it's leaner and healthier and packed with much more nutrition. But, if you, but, it, but it can also be expensive. So the way that you save money is you buy it on sale and freeze it. It can last in the freezer up to, for months. And I also recommend that you buy frozen vegetables. I want you to have fresh fruits and vegetables in copious amounts. I want half of each meal to be colorful vegetables and fruit. But at the same time, that can also run up the budget. So produce can run up the budget. So buy frozen fruit, for example, like blueberries, peaches, stone fruits like peaches and, um, and nectarines and that kind of thing. So buy those frozen and then make sure you keep frozen fruit on hand because not only can you use it um, uh, cooked, but you can also use it in your smoothies. This is very handy to throw in a smoothie. So definitely always buy bananas. I know that they go bad quickly, but that where they mature, get ripened quickly. Dr. But Rowe, you I'm, can save money. I hate to interrupt you, but we are running out of time. And I want to get a question in for folks who are going to meal prep for the new year. The ladies of BNC, some yeah. of us were going on a fast, not a diet. What are some good things we need to stock up on in terms of that list you mentioned that we should buy to eat healthier well, and you snack healthier. You definitely want to, you definitely want to have bananas because you can throw those into your smoothies. You definitely want to have vegetables and, and, and other fruits because you can put them in salads. You can eat, you can bake them. You can, so you can have them cooked fresh or frozen. Um, but the other thing is if you're going to, to get, you, you want to get your meal prep, healthy meal prep, together, one of the things that you're going to do, whatever you buy, you're going to meet, buy these fresh fruits and vegetables, but cook in batches. So if mm -hmm. you're going to do eggs, boiled eggs, cook them in batches. Take your oatmeal, cook it in batches for yourself and for the kids. And you can, you should also be stacking, um, layering foods like oatmeal, overnight oats with fruit, layered with fruit. You can put it in mason jars so that you put it in the fridge in, at night and it's ready to go the next day. Love that. Um, and you can do this with salads as well. Layer your salads in, ma in mason jars, whether you have canned tuna or you have sliced chicken. But you can layer those vegetables that you cut up all in a batch again and layer them. Put your dressing in the bottom of the jar so that when you're ready to eat, you, you dump it out and the dressing, you know, sort of drizzles over your, your, your salad and you're ready to go. But it's a, way, it's a quick and easy way to eat healthy. And when you buy 
um, in bulk and, and cook in batches, this is a way to say to stick with the plan. I love that. Dr. Rowe, tips for the ladies of BNC here when we start our fast on Monday and our viewers as well. Thanks for joining us. Enjoy your weekend, Dr. Rowe.